Hello, I'm Gene Cox and welcome to Snapshot. Today we're in the Chesterfield County Emergency Communications Center with Richard Troshak, who heads up this place and have, has been here for a long time. Tell us, I knew this was here, I've never been here, most people haven't. Tell us what goes on. Well, when there's an emergency, citizens call 911. The call comes into our center. We have trained personnel who actually talk to the person, enter the information in, enter the call for service. We then dispatch police, fire, EMS, the sheriff's department, animal control, whoever's needed to respond to that call. While we're on the phone with them, we're getting critical information, sometimes giving pre-arrival medical instructions to help assist them. When someone calls 911, give us a sense of who they're talking to. These people are well trained and hard working. They're very well trained. We have some very dedicated folks here at the ECC. Um, our folks are work 24 seven to answer the phone, to handle emergency calls. It takes a special kind of person to work here. You're under a lot of stress. You're making very quick decisions. Um, in many cases, people's lives depend on the actions that we take and who we send out and where we send them. We also have to be concerned about the safety of our responders, our police and fire and EMS folks that go out. We need to be getting information to make sure they're going to be safe on the scene of an incident. Years ago, when everything switched over to what was known as enhanced 911, mm -hmm. uh, when a call comes in, the operator can look at the screen and know where it's coming from. Right. But cell phones are taking over the world. How, how do you know uh, when a cell phone call comes in, how to respond to it? Well, that's very challenging. When I started in emergency communications 23 years ago, a cell phone was a luxury. Today, everybody has cell phones. Um, with the old-fashioned wireline phones, uh, we knew their exact location because it was the address that phone was right. assigned to. In today's world, people call from a cell phone many times expecting that we know exactly where they are, and often based on the information that's sent by the network, by the phone networks, to give us that location, sometimes it's not very clear and we have to spend extra time on that call getting somebody to give us specifically where they're calling from. Can they tell you what to do while the ambulance is on the way? Uh, to what extent can they give you medical advice over the phone? All our emergency communication officers are trained as emergency medical dispatchers. This is extensive training on how to actually talk people through dire medical emergencies over the phone. Uh, the most common being CPR. If someone has a heart attack, we actually initiate CPR instructions over the phone with that citizen to help that person as the ambulance is being dispatched. All right, we've been talking with Richard Troshak, who is the director of the Emergency Communication Center in Chesterfield County. Thank you very much for spending time with us. I hope that you all know more about the center now and appreciate the crucial work that it does. For Snapshot, I'm Gene Cox.